up, guys. So, uh, last Tuesday, I was planning on filming my why I chose my school video and um, I got up I had class at 11 I got up at like 9 and I was like okay I'm gonna straighten my hair and then I couldn't get out of bed even though I woke up and then I slept until I had to get up for class so I got up at like 10 45 went to class at 11 and then I started feeling really sick and I thought it was like pressure Maybe maybe my sports bra is just too tight and it's making me nauseous. I don't know So then I kept going to class and then I went to my marketing class and I came back and I Felt terrible, but I didn't have a thermometer and then I had to go to this marketing lab for my class I didn't feel like rescheduling it. Whatever come back. I take my temperature. I had a 102 fever Horrible horrible night like Horrible night. I cannot tell you the last time that I had a fever above 102 and it just kept going up. I don't know how high it hit. It hit at least 102, like 0.5. It was so bad. And then I went to the doctor Wednesday and I had strep. So I was dealing with that all throughout the weekend. Saturday night was the first day I really left my room. It was just, it was not fun. I mean, getting sick at school. I don't recommend it, it honestly sucks I missed an exam making it up this Friday but it just sucks like there there's nothing you can do about it I mean I'm a germaphobe and that's probably why I get so sick honestly but that's why my video hasn't been on you can see on my um, prescription the thing is up. as you can tell my room is a disaster um it was it was not terrible and then i got sick and i just haven't been up to doing anything and also i'm lazy so everything that i wanted to get done last week i absolutely did not do i laid in bed and was bored and i don't know but i took a zen time a little bit i deleted instagram off my phone i needed to take myself out, you know, because I was so addicted to my phone, especially because I couldn't do anything else, and I just needed to remove myself. I also gave Rachel strep. Uh, I only take this sweatshirt off to wash it. <laughs> yeah. I live in this you sweatshirt. Open sweatshirt Shoot, Melody, you're in the mesh of my room. What does that mean? Um, so this device, it meshes stuff. So this is Magic Leap, and Rachel's a nerd, so she is in a class that does this, I don't know. Actually, no, we do, they do virtual reality, but I also do mixed reality stuff. Alright. MLB, or West Point, if I had to decide. Um, probably MLB, because Aaron Judge is my boyfriend. Um... Most used hair products. What's your most used hair product, Rachel? I don't do my hair. Probably the it's a ten, like the leave-in conditioner thing. You want to talk about it? with the purple cat? Fave thing about UM. Um, the classes, the sports. Um, what's your favorite? Me. Yeah. Freedom I have, like, the classes that I take, probably. So I can take classes everywhere. Like, I'm taking, I'm in engineering, but I take classes in business. And I take classes in comm. So that's pretty cool. What, where do people go out on weekdays at UM? Okay, so, weekdays, like, Monday to Thursday, usually they go out to the Grove, where there's, like, what is it, Barracuda? Yeah, Barracuda. Um, Sandbar. There's like a couple bars that a lot of people go out to, or they go to frats. Advice for incoming freshmen. I'm probably gonna do a more in-depth video. Sorry. She looks like a crackhead. I know, I feel like I have to press buttons everywhere. Advice is to enjoy your senior year because at the end of my, well, 
very, very end, I did start to cherish it, but pretty much all of senior year, I didn't care. I took three classes at the end or in the beginning of school. I just really did not care and I didn't, like I hung out with people obviously and I hung out with a lot of my friends, but I didn't really care about anything else. And I wish that I like cherished being home and the things that I could do more than I did because I kind of just wished it away really fast because I wanted to come to school and now that I'm at school I'm like I wish that I enjoyed my senior year more. You look like a stupid. No, because they keep making me go back and forth between here and there. Oh, boom. So yeah, also when you first get to school, make as many friends as you can. People will go floor yeah, hopping. hopping. <laughs> that, first, that first time we went out, that was pretty fun though. Cause like, it was like a very like a camaraderie out, like, outside waiting for Uber. Everyone's like, oh, what, what party are you guys going to? Blah, blah, blah. Everyone went to, <laughs> everyone. Oh, Project X. Okay, this is really funny. Okay, so the first month of school, they were, <laughs> everyone went to Oasis, which is like this hookah bar, and they had this little DJ that was on like a, like a beer pong table pretty much. Like just DJing, yeah. And oh. probably like a DJ space that was as big as this room, and everyone was like jumping around the DJ. It was so funny. So that was Oasis. And then people discovered SQL, and then after SQL, people started like actually branching out. But... A big thing in the beginning of the year was house parties, so I don't even think that they went to UM, they just know that they yeah. could like capitalize on us. They would throw they these huge parties in houses <laughs> and they would call them different names, but one of them was like a costume party and this was in September and people like plugged in the address and there was no house. Oh, project, yeah, project X. <laughs> and so there were people. Apparently, I didn't. I didn't go. Unfortunately, people no, got there. No, not to this party that didn't exist. Yeah, we, did. we were trying to go, and then we were like, "Wait, it doesn't exist." Oh. Like, that's the night that we were yeah, but we didn't dress party. up. We didn't dress up. There's a button. I'm so sorry. There's a button. Oh my god. Okay, so people were actually dressed up, and I mean, guys wear like. Wow. Like girls will dress like very provocative, but guys will dress as like a giant banana, a cow. They'll like actually embarrass themselves, and so they were wearing this really funny stuff, walking up and down the street, very drunk, and so there is no party. <laughs> I need to do work. I, I thought this was gonna take like yeah, five minutes. Yeah, I'm just gonna make you play create. This is really, this is awful. Not scanning. Jul Juliet's walked in and me in this exact situation so many times before. I, this is what happens. Rachel's all up, sit on the ground. <laughs> sit on the ground. Sit on the ground, Melanie. <laughs> we'll, we'll do a recreation. <laughs> <laughs> literally, literally every time she comes into the room. Every single time. Every single time. Rachel goes, I'm playing with astronauts. Yeah, play with the astronauts, Melanie. You can make characters. Like <gasps> it was like popcorn. I made popcorn last night. I got this free bag, so now I just put my bad stuff in it because it's a TikTok bag. Ah! Okay. Couldn't leave me alone for like one an hour. One giant. Wait, no, wait. You did it wrong. What was the thing? Let me know what's up. Leave a comment. Subscribe. And yeah, let me know what else you want to see. Let me know if you like these like chill, chill vibes. Again, I was very sick. I think this week, definitely this week, I'm gonna put up like a normal sit down video, you know? You know? Okay. Peace out. Already pee out.
and shit, a jacuzzi, a theater to watch my movies, couple whips and lots of things. The kids they call the Goonies. Ah. Thumbs up if you know it's on.